We believe the fourth generation Intel Core Ultrabooks are going to be game changers. Uh, this is the first product that we've delivered and, and designed at Intel from the grounds up with Ultrabook in mind. All those other 140 designs I talked about today were things that we had to retrofit that were already in development somewhere through the silicon development process. So Haswell's the first product line that was designed grounds up, fourth generation core, for Ultrabook available later this year. We're going to be able with these devices now to interact naturally with touch and with voice. And so what I'm announcing today is that the fourth generation core Ultrabooks will have mandatory touch requirement. To be an Ultrabook in the fourth generation core, it will be required to have touch. We'll have voice capability, we'll demonstrate that in a little bit. It's going to turn on essentially instantaneously. When you open the lid, within a couple seconds you get access to your data, and it's going to be always fresh data. So what does that mean? Either through Microsoft's connected standby or through Intel Smart Connect, when you open the lid of your computer, all your email will be fresh, all your Twitter feeds, your Facebook, all of your data will be updated already because we have a way to kind of update that while the lid is closed. For all day battery life, what we're announcing today is with the fourth generation core, we're going to be able to deliver the largest battery life increase, generation on generation, in the history of Intel Corporation. Absolutely all day battery life, where you just don't have to bring your power brick at all anymore. With thinner, lighter designs and mandatory Intel wireless display. So we're going to be enabling millions of consumer electronics TVs with people like LG, Samsung, and Toshiba already in the market today, but wide-eye or Intel wireless display will be mandatory for this Ultrabook. It'll also be the most secure platform on the market with anti-theft capability. You can hardware lock your PC if it gets stolen. It'll tell you where it's at. If it's at the taxi cab station in downtown New York, you'll be able to know that it's a taxi cab driver dropped it off there. You can turn it back on with a password. It'll have Intel Identity Protection technology so that you uh, are, have a more secure presence on the internet. It'll require antivirus and anti-malware with more announcements from McAfee coming. And of course, this is where we really unleash the convertible category. So what I thought I'd talk about today is show you the first internal Intel reference design based on not the third generation core, that we talked about with uh, Acer and Lenovo, but what we have internally at Intel now already running on the fourth generation core processor. So this is our concept platform, or our form factor reference design called North Cape, and it's in a full Ultrabook experience, a 17 millimeter Ultrabook. It has a battery both underneath the keyboard as well as behind the display, and the CPU here actually sits behind the display. Uh, this is going to deliver an amazing 13 hours of battery life. So think about the average notebook sometimes taking about four hours of battery life. We're talking about delivering 13 hours of battery life as a full system. But what's unique about this is we've created a one-finger detach mechanism that you can simply remove the keyboard and we've got an amazing tablet experience here. Uh, 850 gram core i5, i7 capable machine uh, at 10 millimeters. It's going to deliver up to 10 hours of battery life. So it has a one-handed detach mechanism. And uh, what's interesting is we've created something called smart frame. So this is essentially 11.6 inch form factor. But what we're able to do is hit a little button here and the screen increases to a full 13.3 screen. So you get a full 13.3 screen experience in 11.6 by using some things around our graphics drivers. And if I, uh, if I test this here, we'll kind of play a high-end racing game, if I'm any good at it. I guess I'm not. But this is something where you now can get, with accelerometers and all of the sensors that were typically only available in notebooks, something that already on third generation core, uh, from Acer and, and Lenovo, we showed is five times the performance of a Tegra 3, and now is going to get even better as we launch this uh, later this year. So, outstanding work by the team at Intel to get this, this going. Yeah.